Um, the Lord fixed it so we had reserved and paid for the shelter. Or if they had been told that there were two shelters and one was under renovation or something till after the DNC, after the Democratic National Convention, and that we could rent the other one. And uh, she was told by the people on the phone who were not familiar, they weren't even familiar with the park, so they were just talking out of their neck. And they told her, yeah, it's the one right next to the water park, and, and yes, and that's where in order to check for them, verify it. And there it was. Mm -hmm. So then we come up there, and there's a lady there. Uh, Audrey went early. The men were meeting there at, at their house at 11.30 to take off. But Audrey left before them, went to the park, and started unloading the stuff and putting it into place. Well, then this other lady comes up after she had started putting the stuff into place and said that she heard for that time. And then, and so it was like, she was saying, well, you know, I got my paperwork in order. So, well, I have my paperwork, too. <laughs> and uh, so the, uh, it was just the conflict, the order, reaffirming. And then uh, the lady must have called, and the park ranger came by, and the park ranger came by, and he said, well, here's the deal, ma'am. We don't have shelter under renovation until after the DNC. And this, 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 the other shelter that you reserved is down the way, and it's the only one that you, that is reserved. This one, he says, is first come, first served. Mm -hmm. He said, so, technically, since you were the first one here, mm -hmm. then we can't make you leave. <laughs> <laughs> so, and we stayed. Yeah, and we stayed. <laughs> and he said, now, he said, but, he was a very nice little uh, black fellow. He said, but down the road, you have a shelter down there that we've been keeping people out of because you have it reserved. So we said, well, you know what? Girlfriend is welcome to go down there to that shelter and have our little birthday party right down there in that shelter. And she'll just stay right here. And the man thanks. Thanked us and he said, You have solved the problem for me. You have made my day easier. Thank you very much. And so we got to stay right there in that uh, great location. And the children had fun in the water, and some of the adults had fun in the water. And, uh, <laughs> and, and, and that was the was, bigger space. And it was the bigger space, nice space, clean. Uh -huh. And the restrooms were there, and they were functional and clean. And the water park, you could just walk in and walk back to the table and get some walk back. And then the, uh, there were many blessings, but the second blessing was there were these little boys there, and they were there with their, their, their mother they said, and um, two of them came over, and they said, uh, they were mixing in with our little ones, and um, they said, well, uh, we want a Coke, and I said, well, we don't, we don't give children Coke, I said, we don't give children Coke, I said, but, uh, and we can't give you anything if, unless you ask your mom. If you didn't have it, because we can't, we don't want to give you something, and mommy get mad at us. And they said, well, she said we could have some. That's her right over there in that car. And there was a car over there with the door open, and they pointed her out. I said, and she said you can have some. And I looked in that direction. So if she thought maybe I was trying to entice her children or something, she could jump out the car and come get it. So I made sure she could see me, and and uh, they said so. I said, well, fine. And so I said, and I, you know, serve them and just let them pick out the juice box and all this stuff. And then uh, the uh, little boy said, well, can we have some of those chips? Well, he wanted some chicken. He said, if I tell the chicken, I'm ready to I said, well, he said, can, I, can we have some chips? And, and, and I said, sure, you can have some chips. And I asked him what kind they wanted. And then the little, the little, the, the taller one said, he said, he said, you know, my mama told me, told told us to sneak, but I didn't want to sneak. Mm -hmm. I wanted to ask. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. I say, now you see that? Mm -hmm. That boy, see the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. All right. yes. 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 
made the truth. That's right. Hey. That was it. Just yeah. bring out the truth. Yeah. And that baby, that baby was so sweet. Yeah. And I told him, I said, you probably could have gotten some chicken and eat a hot crowd long enough. I was looking for them actually. They had gone, but I was going to feed the kids some chicken. How's that? You know. Yes. And I told him, I told him, I said, well, praise God. Aren't you just sweet? I said, bless your heart. I said, you know, anytime you can, you can, you can have anything I have over here. You can, you're welcome to it. And, and, and you know, and, and we, that's fine because I am so proud of you that you did not sleep. Amen. <laughs> you know, try to give him another name. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Still. Yeah. She said, my mom told me to sneak, sneak but I didn't want to sneak. Mm-hmm. I wanted to ask. Amen. And a child shall and a little child shall be them. I hope, I hope that, that you know because that is that is just a blessing. Yeah. You know that was a blessing to me that that baby, you know, out of the mouth of babes and suckling praise is, is perfection, and that baby could see that even though the mama could not. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. She came later. Yeah, she came later. Yeah, Robin, Robin what didn't feel authorized, but now she does. Yeah. I, we are empowered. Uh, uh, you gave us a message one time called "You Have the Advantage," mm-hmm. and uh, that that is the phrase for all of us. We're all authorized. You. That's why we work so hard to teach the word and to and to um, show you the right way and lead you in the right way because each one of us is studied. Each one of us is studied. Each one of us represents study. So you, not only are you represented, represented to just be here and do, do, uh, do stuff with and for study, you authorized to, to, you are study. So you have the power, you have the authority. You, you know, we don't have anybody going around talking about, uh, I got that pastor. <laughs> 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 pastor. Y'all have to ask pastor. <laughs> Amen. Y'all have to ask pastor. Y'all go on and, and, and read in your Bible. The Bible say do it, do it. The Bible say show kindness, hospitality. You do it. You don't have to ask pastor. <laughs> okay? Just go on and do it. Pastor will be fine. <laughs> All in this boat together, amen. 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 So we, we, we'll be just fine. Yeah, um, oh, really? I was thinking it was kind of warm in here. Amen. We're going to talk fast. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't going to be like a preacher. Y'all, the Trump won't sweat me, pouring out, folks, they be mad. That preacher be like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> We're going to get out of here fast. <laughs> amen. Uh, I, well, I, before we have, we are in Second Chronicles in um, in our fifth night or Thursday night Bible study. We, I want to remind you that we have thurs, uh, Thursday night. We stopped doing meeting on uh, third night or Tuesday because it was much. You need time with your family. You need time to, to do a lot of things. There's nothing better. Uh, Two Okay. Uh, time with your family. You know, we want you to have that time. Uh, they've got your phone. Turn it on. Uh, uh, we have we have. Uh, so we did that. We said we just meet the one night. Which was which would be on fifth night or Thursday night, and we said also that on that night we would uh, we would meet for 45 minutes for a topical study or a subject study, and then 45 minutes for a chronological study of the Bible for our born to be beautiful portion. Now we we kept to that, but uh, here's the deal: if you don't say, if you don't tell me. We need to study this, this, this. I would like to study this, this, this. Then I'm going to do what the Holy Spirit is leading me to do. 
So if you don't want to, if you don't want to talk about Bible issues or whatever the Holy Spirit gives me to do, then you need to tell me what you want to do, what subject you would like to study, and we'll roll with that. But uh, because that's that's why I'm here. But if you don't tell me, but the Holy Spirit and I come up with, okay? So, so you need that. And we'll do that. And then we'll also have uh, a board. Uh, we need to start praying for Mr. O'Dell. The cookie gift. Yeah, we need to pray for Amen. It's cool out here. It's not a mic. I'll eat my hair. We can pray in here. Everybody in. Oh, I'm going to go out there. We should give the man. Okay. Is this sugar alone? Do I have lunch? Does he have that kind of issue? Yeah, he has that kind of issue. He says, get some juice. Juice is bad. Juice gets juice. Juice is hard. I hate to tell y'all this. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. I'm not sure how we're going to get it. i my internals are hot. Internals are hot. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, I, I felt it this morning. Yeah, but I can go to my pool. Yeah, and I'll play on. I don't know. I can't put it right there. I know y'all. Y'all are pretty. Y'all be like, it's hot. It's hot. Y'all be like, it's hot. Y'all be like, it's hot. Y'all be like, it's hot.
So I can be challenged for be challenged to bring me back on the stage and pair to the parallel second of passage of that parallel a specific and descriptive passage in Chronicles 15. What that passage was. You figure it out. I didn't tell you what parallel passage was in the new. You figure it out. Settle yourself with I know that when you read it, you're going to say, oh, yes. <laughs> that speaks to me. And I think that like that. And Roger, Roger Bailon comes up. That's his that uh, chapter that he gave me. The few the about the, the, the guys out the going into church and the game, but that uh, moment but is still yours. Now, I have two things that I want you to do now. I'm going to teach you a little, teach you a little etiquette, pedagogy to that. Teachers have to be learners. So I'm going to give you a lesson in learning on your team today. Here's, where, here's what you need to do when you're a passage. I'm going to give you educational jargon. Jargon means the language of a specific sector. I'm going to give it to you in education, and I want you to tell me what it is. Um, this is a rule for teaching, particularly, reading comprehension. Insist that class experiences stay deeply connected to text. So, what does that mean? In classroom experiences stay connected to the text. You're doing what? Nobody else said it now? experience at classroom. Okay. You say the experience of the text you're comparing with Yes, that's pretty bold. I understand what you want to convey to the Stay on point. Right. The activity is the activity and the activity or exercise is not related to what working with what the path that you're on do. Yeah, exactly. mm -hmm. I mean, they might have one where you oh there there is one where you throw the ball to somebody and it's, that means it's your talk. Mm -hmm. And I throw when he works out you throw the ball to somebody else. Well, that's a nice thing. That's fun. But well, what does it have to what you're doing? Mm -hmm. Is it related to what you're doing? So you, your, whatever your exercise is, it needs to be connected to the text. So you don't, everything isn't appropriate all, all acts are not appropriate all of the time. All activities are appropriate all the time. Okay. Now, the next, use evidentiary, use evidentiary arguments to assess the comprehension of now. What does that mean? That's jargon. The big evidence given is to basically confirm what I'm trying to say. So, like, if the word understand what one passage means. When another passage is saying something that, then I keep looking at the verse of the scripture that brings it to, like, fall in the spirit of the Lord, even though, you know, like, for example, God is not the other complete, yet Paul, Paul, you know, God calls the Israel army computers. It was just for that situation, you know what I mean, that, yeah, understanding the spirit of the law, text to confirm the text.
the final segment, the evidentiary to assist competition. Uh, teaching and you're bringing all uh, scriptures, then you should be able to go into a new uh, and get a scripture that is very uh, always a supporting scripture. You know, and you and all to support the okay. So if I ask you, if I give you a piece to do that thing, and then can I ask you, did you understand that? Can you tell me? Yes, I. Well, what's wrong? The question I asked was too general, too nerd. And that's what children do. Like, did you did you read it? And they start reading. And say, did you understand what? You say yes. I, they say yes. <laughs> So you would ask, you would ask questions that would require go to the text to refer it to answer your if that and you say yes, I believe you. Yes, I believe God. You haven't given me enough. You haven't given enough. You haven't given me, given an evidentiary yeah, for why you believe you 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 it. Yeah, you uh, yeah. You could tell me that. And also, they could also say, well, that was something that you did, or maybe your ability to restore itself. And then, sure. then you go and you tell, well, it's kind of hard to restore yourself. From Let's read in here how I <laughs> will raise this person. Uh, when, uh, read in here how he says uh, some of what Mr. O'Neill was doing his passage from the 28. Let's read in here how he says none of the Jesus that he put on the gift would he put on you. And let's read where he, whatever comes on you, he talks to you. Let's read in here for the man who was lame. That's what you that's a venture yeah. argument. Yeah. That's how you prove it to me. Mm -hmm. And uh, and then you can say after you read, then you can say, Well, and I was sick and he healed me. Yeah. Okay. God yes. Yes. And you can say the healer. You have that he healed. And you have your own personal experience. And that's the wonderful thing. It's one biblical proof and then experience to back it up. That first of all, biblical proof. He may choose not to heal you. Oh Lord, why are you talking like that, Mary? Call yeah. off, he's not in the game. That's right. That's right. Wayne, Wayne Watson had a song, he called it Hungry. Mm -hmm. And he called it being with home to be with the Lord. He said home. And then he says eventually at the ultimate he we will be home because the ultimate healing, you're going to be with him. Right. No more pain, mm -hmm. no more sorrow, right. no more sin, no more disease. <laughs> Amen. Amen. So there is an healing, and that and that healing, we should all be looking forward to. Now, I, some of us, some of us are afraid to die. <laughs> but the word says that the fear of death bondage is your own somebody else. That's right. Fear of death. How old are does not have power over you. Does not have power over you. 
mean, if you die, God says that. And if you don't, God, it's as simple as that. I mean, we taking Tim to the hospital. That's gone. <laughs> but this shit just won't die. <laughs> we take him and we go back in. <laughs>
this is what you do to be and keep your covenant, and this is what you lose it. So let's stay on point. Amen. Or now we still live. Yeah. Because <laughs> we can. Once you, once you accept, you will never die. This body won't wear up or wax up and be and expire. It means we'll never die. The spirit man, who we really are, well, we are spirit beings. We have we live in bodies. But we are spirit beings. We are created in the image of God. God is not a man or woman, except for where he chose to show up. He's a spirit. And so we're created in his image. And we must be spirit. So, it's not a matter of authority or of, of female or whatever. Because in the spirit, be a male or female. Look, Miss Ellie has found strong back. You're so mad and I'd be glad to go for him. I think that one.
have the evidence. So when we, when we are, if you want to check your comprehension of truth, you want to see if you really understand, then you need to be able to argue. And I don't mean argue like having a fight, I mean, like debate. Well, yeah, you know, be able to say why. Be be always ready to give to, to those who question. Believe what you believe. Why do you have that have that faith? Why do you have that faith? Why that? Because it is right here. The words the um uh Levitt letter was talking of all these uh, people who you know, Orthodox people who are uh now, because you know, it's 2012. We feel like we can do the study. We want to study Jesus. And one Orthodox Jew who had, he spent to write a book. He wrote he wrote a book called Culture and Jesus. And, and he said uh, he said he had you know he said he would write culture is culture is right. Uh, he went around to Christian churches for over just visiting Christian church. And he said, his summary, the Christians are jealous of the Christians because they are um, they wish he was. I was having come up. This is what I mean. This is, this is uh, uh, what I mean. But they have this enduring hope. You know, he says, well, I'm not going to push up Moses or whatever. That's true. We, you have those people who had all, but yet it has not endured. There, there's no, there's no, there's no Jewish cult that goes around saying Moses, Moses, Moses. Mm -hmm. It's not, because that, that's not enduring. Yeshua is a good and so he says, and they're studying, and there were three different gave quotes from three different, different uh, views and three fields, and all um, made this point that Yeshua was, he was a Jew patriot, that he loved the nation. Said, I've learned so much of Judaism by studying <laughs> the, the New Testament. I'm sorry, I think it's a, she said about my Judaism studying the New Testament. And Yahweh is constantly giving us present evidence. Yeah. Is so they can do scripture and they can study and they can study Christians. We have first hand every that's right. Experiences to obey um, and on time we have and you know people by tradition to hang out. Thank you. But, you know, by going by somebody said or somebody said that we have, and we talk to him and he talks back to him. Amen. No, we're not going to be from on high. And he's good. Oh. Um, we are to pray, and then we're going to pray. Mr. Odell, I think, Mr. Odell, you want, you want to
Anytime you doing working for the Lord, doing exactly what he do, you going to be attacked. But you
Nothing but the 40th anniversary. We're gonna keep our wedding anniversary. December the first. We have the date, and um, it will be coming out soon. You got December fifth. Number one. <laughs> also have um, Mary's. 60th birthday, they will be oh, on no. So these and as we uh, voted, it will be as of this year. Here, oh well, won't be the first, but you know, it will be the first in a long time. We will be having the anniversary I'm thank you, family, now. End of the year is a big, big time. Day two. Thursday, 18th of November. Of course, we don't know. What? Oh. How you all do, bro? No. And of course, the beach is even in January. And we all know who, who comes to the time to stay with the whites for a while and be staying with them now all in all before I do. Uh, Keelan will be going all up to or has already gone to the ECU and she, uh, she didn't get to participate in the race today because she wasn't hanging around there, but she did as she did. I mean, he gave a request for a study, a case that is, oh, that's good, and a good, oh, that she could understand. She kept on reminding she wanted that she break the ball. Dang, clap, thank you for the shot. Huh? So do uh do do the children in your prayer. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, okay. Yeah, Yahweh, we thank you for the food. Yeah. In the name we declare it. Bless. Yeah. Of hurt or harm would come to anyone. Yeah. But rather blessing, nourishment. And strength to do your will, advance the kingdom of God. Yes. We for the offering, Lord God. Thank you. Thank you that you've given and given and given and died to us, and we we want to direct us, show us every place you would have yeah. every to go. Yeah. Because we always be pleasing to you. Mm -hmm. Always be able to stand the screw of God and man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dealings in our financial dealings. Well, thank, you thank you for these children that you have. Thank you. Well, thank you that they grow adults and we pray that we well equipped to give her. Thank you. Thank you, Lord God, for those who are here with us. Lord God, mm -hmm. give us patience mm -hmm. and the wisdom yeah. to deal with them, Lord. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And give them patience mm -hmm. and the wisdom. Because yeah. yeah. we need it, Lord God. Because mm -hmm. we need each other. Mm -hmm. So the foolishness of preaching yeah. bring me into salvation. Mm -hmm. Could have done it yourself. Mm -hmm. Could have had the eloquent angel to preach to us, tell us the way, but you chose to tell us. Thank you, Michael. Help us to be the Lord of God. Help us. 
help us to be teachers, yeah. to, be yeah. to, to be what you call us to be. If you go halfway, Lord God, on the way, give us the way with all the sin of mouth. We're praying now, Lord, we're going to need to pray for our Africa, for the next team to go to the next team to go to Africa. Lord God, we pray that you would just multiply the blessings, multiply the miracles, show yeah, yeah. great and mighty things, Lord God. Give somebody to Christ. Lord, with our brother Anthony, that he's coming, that been partaker with, shown us many things and taught us many things and helped, Lord God, him to convey that to his, his own in an, in an evangelist capacity, Lord God, as he in the church. Lord God, we bless you. We thank you for our sister. Thank you. Yes, Lord. You to give her all the traveling mercies, blessings, yeah. Lord God. Yeah. Everything would be smooth yeah. before this. That there would be no problem. And that all problems we know you're going to look good, yeah. Lord God. Yeah. You're going to hear something they need to hear. Yeah. Something they need to see. Thank you, Lord God. Yeah. For those with birthdays covered up. Yeah. I praise God. Hallelujah. I praise God. My two grandchildren that we stood so much more God. I praise God that we the time we set in this world that you've had people witness to the fact that there are people Lord God. Sometimes we don't see it, Lord God. Thank you for showing, Lord God, that we are. children are blessed. These children that you've given us are an inheritance, Lord God. And you've loaned them to us for a number of good parents, Lord God. That we can, we can listen to the Colbys and the Marlins and the Tays and all those, Lord God. Thank you so much, Lord God. It blesses to our children that we can show them to actually live this life for us. Lord God, we still need to continue with healing and with the restoration of Lord for Tim. Lord God, Shan, Lord God. Yes, Lord. And, and we just will continue to be stuck and yes, Lord. strong about this. Continue to be the Lord. Oh, we bless you. We bless you, honey. Praise you. We bless 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 you. Thank you, Lord. And Father, you uniquely gave us the ability to bless all the people on the earth, thus priests and kings. You gave us the ability to bless each other. Put your name on each other. And where you put your name, you see come to your And so we put you on each other with the words of the priesthood. Yahweh bless us in peace. Y'all can make your face to shine and be graceful unto us. Y'all may lift up your countenance and give us peace. In the name of Shir, Yeshua, Amen. 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 Amen.